Hey guys, Alex Oliver from Broad Productions, and today I'm going to show you a very requested tutorial on how to do picture in picture. Um, this is very easy. It's very, very simple. It only takes literally seconds to do. So, let's get started. Now, I'd like to say this is more commonly known as PIP, picture in picture. Acronyms, they're crazy, right? All right, so basically, it's, it's where you can get a small video and put it over a, a big video like you see on the news when the newscaster is talking and they have a little picture of the guy who killed some other guy, right? So, um, to do this, you're obviously going to need two, foot, your two things of footage. And uh, you're going to need one of your background and one that you want to be the picture over the picture, the, the smaller one. So let's just pretend this uh, stock footage from Video Copilot's Evolution product um, is uh, is is going to be our background, and then we have this other product or uh, <laughs> other picture on top. Now make sure this is on the top layer because you know layers anything on top is going to be obviously on top. So we're going to get this, drag it on top, and then you're going to hit. The, the square vent pan crop button right there. Oh, and the other monitor. There you go. Um, and all you're going to have to do is the little box, not the circle because that's rotate, but get the corner of the box and drag it out. Whoop the do. And there you go. You have it on top of the video. Now, you can move, move this box around and it'll move around to the place you want it to go. Now, that's that's basically it. I mean, there's not really much more to it. It's a very easy effect. And it, you can use it for so many things. You know, obviously you can do the, just the one layer to transform it to how you like. Or you can make, you know, newscast. You can do a lot of different stuff with it. Um, it's great for intros. You can do a, a collage of a bunch of videos. And remember, this isn't just for pictures. You can do the same thing for video. Um, if the two files were video files. I'm just doing it with pictures so it's easier to see. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a really easy effect. Uh, I don't think there's going to be many questions for this, but if you have any, feel free to message me. Just make sure to tell me which tutorial you're talking about because i got a couple tutorials. Make sure you check out all of them. i got some cool intro ones that would, that would help you with this. Um, and yeah, so have a great day and subscribe. Thank you.